Hi, it's TR back with another truck camper restoration video and today we're finally going to start the trim out. First thing I'm going to do today is install my brand new tankless water heater. Got it from Rec Pro. There's a discount code in the video description if you want to pick one up. I swear by these tankless. I had one in my Class A. Endless hot water, sipped propane, an amazing piece of equipment. I'm happy to get it and put it in. Well, I've heard good things about these Fugatis, so I'm happy to get that. Let me give you a shot of the inside here. Got the door. This is the remote for it. This will go inside. I wonder how long the wire is. Eh, fairly long. The remote's not going to be far from it anyway. So let's put this around, put the door on. Okay, let's slip this thing in the hole. The screws are sticking here. to replace this pipe. Okay, I got things squared away here. Got this piece of text in there. Should be good with that. Let's see if it'll fit now. Alright, I do want to have one more screw put in here, like right here. Uh, let's see, what time is it? I'm going to take a little break here, it's getting a little late in the day, i got to go figure out what's for dinner. We're going to work on an item from the checklist, we're going to put in the outdoor shower. This is the box for it. I believe it looks like this. You can see how this box is kind of all warped. So what I'm gonna do is, I'm gonna come in here and get one side set. Right, 
need to turn this down. Let's see. Okay, this nylon ought to warm right up and should go fit right back into shape. Continuing to work on this outside shower, we're going to go ahead and do the plumbing fixture, which is this guy. Should fit right in there like that. There's two plastic nuts that go on the. These two nuts go right here. Got some three quarter inch butyl tape here. I'm just gonna take this guy up. Actually, we're gonna go over here and tape it up. Come with me. So I got this up here, put the butyl tape on the back of it, and throw some screws in it here. Don't worry about these white screw heads, they're gonna get covered anyway. And then there's a little door latch that'll sit up here that will hold this open. Now all that's left is there's a gasket. There's some weather stripping. I've got some neoprene coming to use the seals around these doors. And then this gets covered up too with some neoprene. Should look pretty good. All right, just continuing to work on a few little details here. I've got to get some this neoprene weather stripping in here. Bottom of this door gets a strip right up against this lip. So.
nice and tight really good center this on the sink Let's see where's the holes okay like right there maybe back a little yeah let's go back a little let's go back to where we just cover those holes like right there all right that's where we want our hole Well, this bit is dull as dull. I can't even get it to start. Let me get a different, sharper bit. Woo! Man, I think that hole saw is, uh, <laughs> just about had it. trick is can I get this all fish down through here oh I see what that third one was for, was for. all right that's the actual spray connection thing oh, Finish this up here. I might need to go outside. Let's, uh, let's bring this guy down a little bit so I can bring this up pretty flush at the bottom. screws to do the rest of it. So let's get this one started. It goes right there. Alright, so I got some Teflon tape on here. I'm going to fit this guy up in here. 
this they got this washer in here for some reason i don't know if i put the washer in there it takes up all the space for the thread so i'm gonna guess that it's just this yeah, feels like it's tightening up Well, won't be able to test it for a while, but okay. Okay, that does that end of it. So, if you found value in this video, give me that thumbs up. I always appreciate that. If you're not subscribed, do subscribe. Ring the notification bell. Lots of videos still to come on the truck camper restoration. Got a few things left to do. Got to finish all the plumbing. A few little electrical bits left. Trim it out, which we're going to be working on next. So stick around for that. But for now, it's time to go. Thanks for watching. I sure do appreciate it. Until we get together for another truck camper restoration video, peace.